ridiculed everyone on the roster. And I just want to say from the bottom of my heart, I'd like to take this chance to apologize to absolutely nobody. The double champ does what the f he wants. So recently I started watching Ted on Peacock, the, the TV series. And let me tell you something real quick. I'm not going to try to make this video that long or anything. Now, I, I really enjoyed the original Ted film. The sequel, I'll be very honest, I haven't finished it. And it just, for some reason, mm, didn't really work with me. Just the, the premise of the story. So when I heard that they were going to make a Ted, uh, I guess you could say, show or series... I was confused because I was like, well, well where are you going to do it? Where is it going to take time? Well, I guess they 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 set it around the 90s. Somewhere around there. And look. Uh was it the 90s? Maybe 80s or 90s, somewhere around there it's set in. And look, I I I think it's a fine show. It has some funny stuff. Um, I think when the show focuses on Ted and uh, what's his name? What's the kid's name? Ah, man, I forgot what his name is. But when they focus on Ted and the kid, it's phenomenal. It, it's it's hilarious. It has some, you, you can notice a little sprinkle of some wokeness in there, but it's still fun. When it focus on the mom and dad, they're fine. I think the dad... Uh, he's more like this crazy guy, like he's this war veteran, Vietnam veteran. Um, it's fine. Uh, the mom is more of that shy uh, kind of a lady. Like uh, she plays uh, uh, Peter Griffin's wife uh, pretty close to that style of character, but a little bit more shyness, more quiet, more weird I guess you could say but there's a character in this series that is straight up annoying straight up woke identity and that is the character of Blair which is supposed to be the cousin of the kid now we never heard nothing about Blair in the original Ted movie, nor as far as I know, never heard anything about it in Ted 2. So all of a sudden, they put in this character who is annoying. And not only is she annoying, but the character just doesn't work. The actress just doesn't work. But here is the worst fucking shit about that character. It's filled with political correctness. It's filled with political nonsense, ideology, and all that shit. Now, like I said, when it focuses on Ted and the little kid or the high school kid, it's funny. But whenever that bitch is on fucking screen, you're getting the he, she, which makes no sense because back then nobody talked like that. When you say the word midget or little people, nobody ever gave a fuck about that shit back in the day. So it it has a lot of wokeness. And I seen some people say, well, this is really more of the, the Blair TV show instead of Ted. And I can see why. But yet again, I seen three episodes and I can just say, when you're watching it, when Blair comes on, I will mute the fucking TV. Because look, they're making fun of the right, they're making fun of the left, but at the same time, it's just annoying because this is not how people would talk back then. That's the part that fucking pisses me off. Nobody would talk like that back then. But because we're living in the fucking crazy leftist mind nowadays, everything has to be political 
bullshit, right? At the end of the day, let me know, have you guys seen Ted, the TV show, the TV series, whatever you want to call it? Uh, let me know what you guys think down below. And if you guys enjoy this video, make sure to leave a like, make sure to subscribe, and I'll catch you guys next time. I just leveled up, I thank God. Straight from the